Hello and welcome to the second in Targus's CES video showcases, brought to you from the four walls of my home office. You know what though? I'm saving on the shoe leather and those of us who've been doing CES over the years can seriously appreciate that. I also appreciate being able to work around the house, take all the accessories, stuff them in a backpack and put them on the shelving unit behind me. Let's join Andrew Corkhill and the rest of the Targus crew down in Anaheim, Southern California. Andrew, hello. Hey, great to see you again. Welcome back. Good to see you too. So for those viewers who haven't seen the first in our CES video showcases, let's just remind them of some of the innovations that we saw there. Sure, we saw a lot of really cool innovations in our first set. We looked at the UVC LED disinfection light, which actually will shine a light on your desktop and disinfect anything that's there. We saw the tablet cradle workstation where you can take your Samsung tablet put it inside the cradle, and you have a Samsung DeX experience, the desktop experience. It's great for mobile workers. We saw the quad video docking station, where you can have four 4K monitors functioning on your desktop. And we looked into MirrorLogic. MirrorLogic is smart docking. That gives you full insights into what's happening at the desktop, whatever's plugged in, what power consumption is being used, and active insights into the entire desktop in your business. Yeah, I think that's amazing for IT managers to be able to see how their resources are being used. But from a consumer point of view, the idea that I could plug my laptop in and simply just get four 4K feeds from my laptop is crazy. Uh, just talk us through what we're going to be seeing in this particular showcase. This is going to be playing to your more traditional strengths of bags and cases, but this year there's a twist, I guess. Yeah, that's right. We'll be looking at backpacks, briefcases, tablet cases, but now we're going into antimicrobial technology. We're also looking at eco-conscious products. So these are products that are good for you and the environment. These are sustainable and they're really healthy for the earth. And I suppose one other important factor this year is that people are just working anywhere and everywhere. I speak from personal experience. Um, you're gonna be focusing on how to cater to people wherever they are. That's right. So, I mean, you need products that keep you mobile. So mobility is really important. No matter where you're working, in the home, in the office, you've got to be on the go. So we have a lot of products that allow you to do that. Andrew, thank you. Do stick around. We will see you later on. In the meantime, I want to get stuck into some of the actual products, don't we all? Let's bring in Joanne Sessler, who is the design guru at Targus. Hi, Joanne. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Good, thank you. A little bit cabin fever going on here. I can't wait to actually get out and explore the real world again. Um, this idea of how we're all going to be working, it's obviously something that you specifically and you at Targus more generally have been giving a lot of thought to, haven't you? So just tell me what you've been finding out. Yeah, once the pandemic happened, the whole design team started to really drill down into this idea that if we're not going to be going to the office and being able to leave all of our things around like we did when we had hot desking, then we need this idea of clean desking. And so this the concept was the two office bag and this way you can carry everything that you need with you. Um, so I can walk you through all the features of this bag. Please do. Yeah. So the idea is that basically we're cleaning up the office and just taking it to our other office because we have got makeshift offices in some form or other at home now. So this is the perfect way to get from point A to point B. So talk us through the bag. Great. So the bag, first of all, we knew that the, you were going to have a lot of heavy things in here. And so ergonomics are really important to us and how you carry things. So what you'll first notice about this bag is it's very slim because it's really important to carry the weight really close to the top of your back. And then the fabric interior fabric exterior fabric have been treated with an antimicrobial finish as much as the zipper pullers the zipper tape the air mesh that's in the back and then all of the webbing has been treated with antimicrobial protection so everywhere that really needs it has it just tell me about the kind of choices you made i know there's a lot of different ways of getting antimicrobial protection in there copper and other materials what have you chosen and why 
So we are really dealing with a product that is silver ion, and silver ion works really well for textiles, and it also works really well with your body. And it actually is able to ward off the growth of bacteria. The way that this gets put into the material is that it's done at the dyeing and finishing state, so it's actually impregnated right into the fiber, meaning that not only is the efficacy going to be very high, but it lasts all the entire length of the life of the product. So you don't have to worry about this bag, you know, having something wearing off. But what's great about it too is you're still not having to forfeit this idea of heavy DWR, which is durable waterproof finish, which is actually going to make this bag water resistant, weather resistant for light snow and rain. The other thing is that you've got these removable pouches in the front which are really great because you can take all of your tech accessories and also your supplies with you. Um, and then we've also added a lot of pockets, key pockets that you want to get into. For instance, I always want to get to my phone really fast is in the top. And so you always have a separate laptop compartment for your laptop. And then the main part of this bag opens up with a clamshell opening that allows you to take everything with you, including my keyboard. And there's lots of pockets in here, um, and we actually have a guide printed on the inside of it so that everybody understands how to use this bag to the best of your ability. So you'll see that I've got a tablet in here, I've got my sketchbook, I've got a mouse, I've got headphones. I've got everything in here that I possibly could use. Um, so this is the idea of this bag, and it will last a really, really long time. Look at that. That really is extraordinary. You've got basically everything you might need to be productive when you're at home, whether you're at work. It just covers everything. I love that. Now, the other thing that you've really been on a very conscious push towards is sustainability, as Andrew mentioned earlier. Talk us through some of the other products that you have uh, that really play into this idea. Yes, you know, Targus actually has been playing in the sustainability area for a while, starting with the spruce bag that started in uh, 2009. And we continued this at last year's um, CES with the Cypress bag. These bags, all the textiles are made out of post-consumer recycled polyester, which actually is a very fancy name for what water bottles look like after they've been repurposed. So just to get this straight, you have a bag made out of dozens of water bottles, effectively. Yes, and so the reason why it works with water bottles is because it's something that everybody uses all over the world. They are a product that can actually be collected, and there is technology around for many decades on how to recycle. It's really, they are collected, they're put into a cleaning and flaking process, then they, are, they go back into pellets, and they get heated up and extruded back into fiber, which is what you see here. But it's not just, of course, about the bags, right? Your eco-conscious sustainability principle is really prevalent throughout the entire product range, or a lot of them, certainly. Yes, it's really important for us to recognize that materials in the world, you know, raw materials, there is a finite amount of raw materials left in the universe. And so this idea of actually going into a circular economy is so important for us. And so using the principles of that, we've actually are going to be launching this year at CES, the EcoSmart Tablet Collection. So with the tablets, um, the folio cases, you have a lot Lot more materials involved. You've got post-consumer plastics and then you also have uh, microfibers and then the addition that's really kind of interesting is that this tray is made out of bio-based material. Amazing. So you've got tablet cases, you've got eco-smart thinking into your bags as well. So really covering off the entire spectrum of environmentally sustainable products. Joanne, thank you so much. Do keep well and hopefully I will see you perhaps next year at CES. You too. 
Okay, so we've just heard Joanne talk a lot about different cases and the design principles that go into these. Let's join Johnny Ewan, who is Targus's global design manager. Johnny, you are heavily involved in the design of a lot of your accessories and products. Let's just delve deeper into what goes into some of these designs of things like cases. So what have you got in front of you there? Yeah, so right here what we have is our, our Targus rugged safe port case. Uh, this is a new ground up case that we've developed. Um, what we wanted to do is, you know, to really work off of our safe port rugged, but uh, build up, the, you know, the protection aspect of it. Um, the physical protection of your devices, that's the, the core of Targus. Um, you know, with our rugged case that we have here, uh, we've developed this from ground up. Um, using new materials, using innovative materials to keep the, you know, the case light, slim, and you know, more protective. The thing that we've actually put into this case is uh, this new polymer here uh, that you can see that's highlighted in the corners uh, in blue. What this material is, is a special material that we've developed with our resin supplier. And actually this material actually you know, absorbs shock impact. Not only that, we've also added um, antimicrobial additives into our, our resins. And you've got cases for everybody. So obviously that I presume can survive a drop test, but also you have other cases just depending on quite literally different uses. So maybe the new use case, if you'll yeah, pardon Yeah, absolutely. Pump. So yeah, so definitely we have, you know, our VersaView, our popular VersaView case. You know, this is for you know, the, you know, the average consumer that needs functionality and rotation, uh, but yet still have protection of their device, uh, which is still mil-spec certified. Uh, we step up to a little bit more protection of our, our ProTech. Uh, again, you know, screen protection at its, uh, you know, at its core. Uh, and then definitely the safe port rugged you know, is for that prosumer or commercial type of uh, user. I'm very interested in that last uh, object, the more industrial sized and grade protection, because one of the challenges there is how to keep your device protected, uh, but also protected from uh, maybe somebody who might be uh, wanting to get their hands on it. So how do you do that? And also how do you integrate it into people's working lives uh, more comprehensively as well? Yeah, for sure. Um, we have uh, you know customers that need you know, cases protecting their devices, but also need functionality too uh, in that uh, work environment. Uh, so we have our, you know, uh, Tab Active 3 for, for Samsung, uh, a lot of function here, uh, but add, adding more functionality, giving our customers um, more flexibility in that workspace, uh, we have our workstation. Uh, this is our Gen 2 workstation uh, with our, you know, Tab Active 3. Um, right now, it you know, has a security lock here that you can actually lock and unlock your device into this workstation, um, taking it in and out. Now, we also uh, added flexibility for our customers, too, to add docking features. And that's one of the uh, core uh, competency that uh, Targus really has in docking. So we have uh, a lot of features to allow, you know, connecting your external monitors, your keyboards, your mice, uh, and you also having uh, Ethernet port too as well. Um, but again, you know, taking that security to the next level, not only you can lock your device into the workstation, but you can actually secure your workstation to the work table surface. Uh, we have uh, added accessories that we can actually uh, bolt onto the uh, workstation, the bottom of the workstation, and bolt it and secure it to the table. So you've got security and versatility built into that one product. Now, a lot of these products presumably take years to design, years to make, and that takes a company with significant resources to be able to think deeply about this. Just give us an insight into the design process, not just of these products, but also of another product that you are very heavily involved in, which is the UVC disinfection light that offers the ultimate grade of uh, protection for us uh, against any kit that might be dirty. Yeah, especially with uh, our current environment, uh, you know, our customers and users, they need protection against these viruses and pathogens and bacteria and whatnot. Um, so our, our new UVC light 
actually provides a lot of that protection, especially when those uh, you know work environments, you know people still do need to you know have their desk space cleaned. Uh, with our product here, um, we're able to allow that cleaning, disinfecting, you know, um, constantly working while you walk away from your desk, uh, reducing the amount of chemicals that you need to to wipe down your keyboards and mice and desks. Uh, this actually solves a lot of that uh, problem. So really the ultimate in protection for you and for your devices. Johnny Ewan, thank you very much. Keep safe. Yeah, thank you. Some great accessories there. Now, of course, you're going to need somewhere to put those accessories. Joanne earlier was talking about the two office bag, where we're going from our home office to our work office, back to our home office to our work office. But we don't all work like that, and we're not all going to be working like that. Let's bring in David Durantis, who is the product guru at Targus, the bag guru. Hi, David. Hi, how are you doing? Good, thank you. So what is your research telling you about how we're going to be functioning in this new world when we finally emerge post-COVID? Yeah, when we're talking to consumers, we're realizing that the office environment is changing. It's no longer going to be just in the office. Obviously, with the pandemic, things have totally evolved, and we foresee that that's going to continue to happen. And what that means is there's a lot of flexibility, and with that flexibility, there's also an extended day. You're not just restricted to the office, you're actually moving around. You're going to be doing meetings from a coffee shop during your commute. You might want to go to the park, and in the middle of the day, you might even want to go to the gym. So all these things extend your workday, and we offer solutions now that are addressing those, uh, that extended workday. So show me exactly what you're talking about in terms of what that means when people are carrying around their accessories. I got a great example, and that is our Work Plus backpack. Let me show you. Um, oh, I think it's this one here that you sent up to me. Hang on, let me just send it your way. Yeah, that's it, thanks. Okay, so talk to me about some of the features in this bag. Sure, this one's loaded with features. First off, protection is first and foremost. That's what Targus is known for. In the laptop compartment, there's a sling system. And what the sling system is, is an actual, it's kind of like a hammock for your laptop. And what, it suspends your laptop so that way when you drop the, the bag, your laptop is safe from damage. Additionally, what we've done is we've also added a shoe compartment. The shoe compartment allows you to carry a change of shoes if you want to, if you want to have a professional um, shoes and then you want to switch to athletic shoes, you can do that. Because obviously they're dirty and you don't want that dirt to be touching your technology and they could potentially even be wet. So we've got the separate shoe compartment. Show us the other internals. Yeah, so if you open this up, you have a a spacious compartment with organization on the inside, enough space for, let's say, a tablet, all your technology accessories, your work products like pens and pencils, and so forth, all compartmentalized so you have different places to keep your, your tech organized. And this is a really small thing, but I've noticed that the inside is a kind of yellowy color, and that's actually a great contrast color because so much of my kit is black. And if I have it in a black bag, it's not easy for me to see at a glance exactly what I've got. Absolutely. It was purposely designed to be that way. So that way, when you open up the pack and you're looking for something small, the bright color really lights up the area, especially if you're commuting on a train. It might be a little darker. Uh, so you want to be able to find your accessories and the bright interior really helps with that. Let's talk about the water resistance aspect here. So you mentioned, you know, wet shoes. To what degree are the bags water resistant? Yeah, we also take into consideration rain um, and what we've done is we've added uh, water resistant coated zippers so that way there is some rain, your device is protected from that moisture. So that's one bag, but you've got bags really aimed for all of us no matter what kind of consumer we happen to be because we don't always need the same kind of features in a bag, right? Correct. So we have different types of bags for different types of consumers. And obviously now with there's much more emphasis on commuting, we have to make sure that we provide the right style for your needs. So for example, we have our Invoke line. Our Invoke line it uses a brushed fabric material and it is also water resistant coated along with the zippers themselves are, have the, the nylon coating so they are 
protect it against rain as well. And what kind of consumer is that aimed at? Oh, this is designed for the contemporary professional. And the contemporary professional is looking for something with a clean aesthetic. For example, the water bottle pocket isn't immediately obvious, but it is part of the material, so you don't really see that. Um, you, there's also the expandable nature of the bag. It's got a zipper that allows you to expand it to give you over 25% more capacity. And in terms of the material, what kind of material are you using that, again, elevates your product over the competition? Yeah, so we use a higher denier brushed fabric, so that way it adds some dimension to it while still giving it that uh, durability that you need when you're on a commute. So we've talked about the modern professional, but there are quite a few of us, I exclude myself from this category, who are more inclined to be kind of more sports oriented. Uh, so what have you got for them? Yeah, we've I've identified this athleisure trend and that's with people working from home. People are a little bit, are wearing things that are much more comfortable. So the bag should reflect that style. And we have our Conquer backpack collection, which has sporty features and sporty type materials that really address that athleisure market. What I like about them is that they look very slim and slender and low profile, and yet there's lots of compartments and lots of very cleverly thought out space for all the things that you may need. Yeah, I mean, we purposely design them so that they look thin, right, at first glance, but then have expandability. So you can open it up. And now if you have need more capacity, for example, if you have like a helmet for your e-scooter, you want to have more capacity in your bag, you unzip it, you expand it, and then you're able to put that helmet into the bag. Well, again, some very purposeful innovation and design there. David, thank you so much. So we've been hearing all about backpacks and bags for us adults, but what about the kids? Surely we can't leave them behind. Let's bring in Candice Brown to talk about what Targus is doing for our children. Hi, Candice. Hi, Rich, how are you? Just about surviving. My two kids have been at home for the last 10 months and we're all kind of literally socially distanced at home, I think, at this point. My kids are in their rooms on their devices. I can barely pry them away. They seem to be on it 24-7. So my question to you is, what do you have for me to make sure that my investment in my kids' gear is protected and also that I can make sure that they're actually productive and not just playing games or watching who knows what? Targus has tons of gear, from tablet cases to Chromebook cases, laptop bags, keyboards, and mice. Okay, so one key question I have, Candice, is how you're going to protect my kids' gear, or even the gear that I give them to use, because I have a whole graveyard of stuff, this laptop being one of them, where they manage to completely break the screen by just jabbing their finger at it. I've got a whole graveyard, as I say, so how do you help protect my investment in the kit that I'm buying for my kids? Sure, that crack does not look good at all. <laughs> we actually have uh, some tablet cases that survive a four foot drop test. It also offers screen protection, which uh, kids need because they are pretty rough with their devices as, we, as we've seen. Exactly, and they're using it all around the house as well. Now, what about in terms of keeping our kids themselves healthy? What about keeping their environment, their working or productive educational environments healthy? What have you got for that? We have a few things. So we do have a disposable stylus, which is meant to be thrown away after every use. So that way, every time you're using one, you're using a fresh, clean stylus. And then for those of you that are eco-conscious, we have our washable styluses that you can wash after every use so that you are using a clean and fresh stylus every time. Uh, we also offer our antimicrobial keyboards and mice, which has built-in antimicrobial material. And these aren't just keyboards, of course, for laptops, which already have the keyboards in them. These are keyboards that can drastically enhance their productivity, right? Absolutely. We're helping with that uh, with our Bluetooth keyboards and mice that helps turn your kids' tablets into a laptop experience. So what are some of the interesting features on the keyboards and mice that maybe differentiate you from, from the competition? So one keyboard we have that I'm very excited about is our foldable keyboard. So once you're done using it, you can fold it up, put it in your bag and not think about it until it's time to play with it again. And how much of this thinking was under a new kind of theme? Because obviously COVID changed everything for everyone and the way our kids are being educated also obviously changed radically. So is this a different line of thought that's going down at Targus? 
yes, we've thought about how we're going to completely redo education for students because we can't forget about our kids. Not only are adults working from home, but kids are as well, and we can't forget about them. So we've created an entire line for students uh, that they'll be able to use this school year and school years to come, um, whether they are working solely at home um, or they're going back to the classroom or they're doing a hybrid approach where they're working at home and in the classroom. Fantastic. Well, hopefully I can get them off Fortnite and we can actually make them properly productive. Candice, thank you so much indeed. Well, let's bring back Andrew Corkill. Andrew, over the last little while, we've seen so many different ways of protecting you, protecting your gear, protecting the environment. And I suppose that's what elevates you from your Me Too competitors who try and enter a space that you are really pretty legendary in. That's right. I mean, at Targus, we really try to have a global perspective. We sell into over 100 countries globally, and you really need to examine that and look deep into it to understand how are people working at home in every country and how are people commuting and going back to work. So at Targus, we sell products into over 90% of the Fortune 1000 companies, and they rely on us to understand that and be able to provide those solutions to make people more productive and efficient. So for those viewers who are in those 100 countries or more, where can they find all the details about pricing availability? For pricing and availability on everything we've talked about, you can find it right at Targus.com. Andrew, thank you so much. Thank you so much. It was great to see everybody. I'm so happy everybody was able to come today. Have a great year. Thank you. Well, yes, it was great for me to virtually see everybody and for everyone to virtually see me. I'm just hoping that by CES 2022, we're back in Vegas having some fun, walking the halls. In the meantime, everyone, keep safe. I'm going to try. Take care. Bye-bye.